reason allowed in the masjid? Fund and not fun. <laughs> <laughs> fund. <laughs> uh, fund raising for the masjid, meaning that people asking money from other people. Prophet ﷺ inside his masjid, he asked for that. He asked for that for twice. Number one, he saw these people who are poor coming and Mushtabin Nimar, Mudar, tribe of Mudar. Most of them are really, he was really sickened with this. And then he talked about the Sadaqa and the charity of the Sadaqa and they saw the virtues of the Sadaqa. One companion came and he brought this and that much and until he got piles and the Prophet was smiling because of that. So that's raise, uh, fundraising. Also, one day the Prophet said, he had called for Sadaqa. Uh, Omar he said, I'm going to be beating, defeating Abu, Abu Bakr, I'm going to win over him. He wanted and brought half of his money, where Abu Bakr bought all his money. That's fundraising, is no problem. But the fundraising which I've got an issue with is the one which starts boasting and start humiliating the person as well. And you find that this, you are encouraging people to show off. Okay. So this person stands up. Okay, who's going to be now? I'm going to start with 10,000. Who's going to be 10,000? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, that brother, such brother, mashallah, stand up. He's 10,000. Mashallah, tabarakallah. And then the guy who comes with the who puts paper is not. This is pledges, call it pledges. Pledges or could be straight away money, I don't know. And, and then there, there will be a race. The intention is not to race here for the sake of Allah, for the sake of my, the eyes of the people other than him. I got the maximum. I've got a problem with that. Prophet Salim, he said it openly, okay? And then when they came, he asked, just this year, he said, ask the Umar and Ha Umar, he didn't say to him how much he gave, no. That's irrelevant. How much you left for your family. That's the most important thing. So he said, I left half. Abu Bakr came. How much you left for your family? Abu Bakr. He said, I left them Allah and his messenger. Now, you have to understand, maybe Omar brought in terms of money-wise more than Abu Bakr. But he left half. Let's say he got 100 pounds, he took 50, left 50. And Abu Bakr maybe had 25 pounds. He brought the 25 pounds. Left him nothing, except for Allah and his messenger. So that's the important thing. So that's why the Prophet of Allah said, one dirham had preceded in rewards 100,000 dirham. How? This person has got two dirhams. He gave charity for one dirham. He gave charity for half of his money. And that person's got an ocean of money. MashaAllah, millions. He took from that ocean 100,000, which is peanuts, kind of Coke. And he gave it. Rewardable, but there's not as much as rewardable as the one that dirham, which is half of the money. So the Prophet, he never asked, how much, yeah, Abu Bakr? Ah, how much is Umar? They're going to bring more. No, how much he left? Half. And he didn't ask him how much he left in terms of money. money. No, how much he left? As in, he took half, quarter of it, instead of it. That's how it is. Now. Is that a lot of